Hey guys, D. Jackson back in Surprise, Arizona, and talking to these elite athletes. You know, they used to be kids one day, and kids look up to these guys. And there's a place that you can actually train just like the pros. It's the Sports Medicine and Performance Center. And even the guys from the TV crew, like Joel Goldberg, for instance, shows us how even you can work out like a champ. We're talking about the University of Kansas Health System and the great workout facility and I hear that you have been spotted there working out from time to time. Is there any truth to that rumor? It's a very true rumor. It's a very awesome place to work out and great people and you know, I've really enjoyed it and especially for me too with, with how busy I can be and how busy I'm going to get to be able to have that time to get in there, use the facilities, uh, tap into the expertise there has been really beneficial for me. You know, one of the cool things about it is people forget that you know, we've seen some of the players come through, you're there, but Joe Public can walk in off the street and get the same type of uh, experience that the Royals get and that you get. How cool is that for, for you to go to a place where you know you can get the same workout as some of these players? Well, here's what I like. I mean, I'm just Joe Schmo from the street that happens to be on TV, but I'm no different in terms of athletic ability or how much I like to work out than, than the average person that lives next door to us meaning that I'm not at the level, never have been, never will be, of those athletes that come in there. And I never feel intimidated. I think that's one of the things that a lot of people feel walking into a gym is when you have somebody that's that's at a different level than you or certainly a professional athlete, that could be a little bit intimidating. Like, wait, do I belong here or not? I don't feel that here. And really, I think one of the things that I've noticed with all the different higher level athletes that are in there, you're right, it's a mix of not just them, but anyone from out in the public. And there's not that aura of, oh, look at them. They're just getting work in and they're doing their work. And just the same for me or anybody else that's in there. It's a great place to work and no one's looking or judging anyone or, or competitive or anything like that. And, you know, you get to kind of you know, rub elbows with these guys and kind of overhear things. And you've been around Dr. Key, you've been around Nick Kenny. What is it about this staff that keeps these guys in such great shape? Well, they're, one, they're experts at what they do. But two, they're good people. So they know their field as well as anyone, but they know how to connect. And I think one of the biggest keys with these athletes who are getting younger and younger by the day, as all of us and certainly medical staff are getting older and older, is that you have to build those relationships. And that's one of the things that Dr. Key and, and everyone affiliated with the University of Kansas Health System does so well, is that they understand how to connect with everyone, including those superstar athletes, the, the Royals and the Chiefs and the guys that are in the spotlight, and also understanding that they're all different. They're no, in that sense, no different than any of us. You've got some that are loud, some that are quiet, some that are introverted, some that are extroverted, some that are high energy, some that like to kind of be in the background and be quiet. And so I think what, what so many of the, the experts and, and those at the University of Kansas Health System do so well is they figure out how to connect with these guys. Speaking of connection, there's a very unique program that the University of Kansas Health System offers where there are athletic trainers that are provided on the sidelines, uh, court side. You know, there's always somebody there for these kids, middle school kids and high school kids. How much of, a, of an advantage is that for these kids? Because they have the same uh, access to great health care as some of these professional players. Well, first and foremost is they have access to health care, which is impressive. And I think that for a lot of those kids, the teenagers, to sit there and, and say, wow, I'm getting the same type of treatment as the professionals, that I actually am working with trainers and physical therapists uh, and people that can take care of me and make me better that are following the same protocol as the Royals might have or the Chiefs might have, that, that's gonna wake up any athlete from a kid's standpoint, I think from a parent's standpoint, and I'm a parent too, to know, hey, my kid has the best treatment is huge. And let's be honest here, if these superstar athletes that are getting paid a lot of money to perform at the highest level, under a microscope, all the spotlight, all the attention, are getting that type of treatment, and then you feel like your kid, or you as a teenager, are getting that same type of attention, that feels pretty good. So no matter whether you're an all-star or a weekend warrior, there's a program specifically designed just for you over at the Sports Medicine and Performance Center. Remember, it's the University of Kansas Health System and the Kansas City Royals, a winning combination.